But I originally had um, applied for an MVQ and the college that I applied for, they basically put me in touch with Forrester Bradford and ever since then I've been joining in with various things here and there. I think the one thing I've like the most is the food out of the people really. Oh, I think beet is fantastic. Um, the tree plantings that have been going on over the past few years, you know, we're starting to see them now. You can see them, the growth that they've done. Um, all the community projects that they get involved in, you know, it really does help people come together as a community and they work together on areas and it's brilliant. It's really good. Reed paint has been recycling paint um, in Bradford for the last six years. Uh, we collect paint from household waste sites uh, throughout Bradford and within Wakefield, bring it back and give it out to people in need to redecorate the homes, community centres, schools and churches. Reed have helped me greatly uh, for the last couple of years um, with funding advice, um, any information. The knowledge is fantastic upstairs. Um, Any time I've got a problem, I go to them and they always come back with an answer. Why West helped us kit the scrap store out from the start. Uh, since then we use Y Waste regularly and we get lots of interesting things from them and for us it's fantastic because it cuts out the time that we um, take looking for businesses, sourcing scrap um, and trying to find the different range of scrap materials. We've been involved with the Bradford Real Nappy project for the last four years. Working with lots of different people, it's quite obvious that some people still haven't heard about real nappies and natural nappies. So it's really great to have that opportunity to share that information with them so they can understand the great benefits of using them, as we've said about environmental and the health issues, and becoming more aware of those issues so they can make their own decisions. Well, it was environmental reasons. You know, obviously, when you're going to have children, you think about the sort of legacy of you know what you're leaving for them and what the planet's going to be like, and the thought of you know all those disposable nappies lying in landfill sites that they're going to have to end up you know coping with and clearing up just seems ridiculous. Having the Bradford Real Nappy Project is really important because um, obviously you can go there and you can get hold of nappies and you can buy second-hand nappies from them. And it just means that if you've got any questions, you know, there's somebody there that you can get in contact with. And I think it is really important to support parents that are trying to do the right thing. Um, and that's really what people need. They need to know that there's somebody there they can talk to about it. And um, Bradford Real Nappy Project provides that. And it's a great facility for us in this area. the people that have been involved with Beat and their passions and enthusiasms that have driven the whole thing and the whole shape of it and all the projects that we run. I feel quite fortunate actually to be working for an organisation where you can pursue your interests and your enthusiasms like this. It feels almost quite indulgent really for me to be working for Beat. I am 
enormously proud of what Beat's done. I mean, I mean, if we can walk away today, I mean, we can be enormously proud of what we've achieved. I just can't believe how it's developed actually. It's been I'm gonna cry now. <laughs> I'm gonna have all emotional. <laughs> yeah, go on. Well it's really great that we've been going ten years and that we'll just have a great night, great celebration, and here's to the next ten. Thank you very much and go on for another ten years. I think Beat have done a fantastic job and it's brilliant that it's their 10th anniversary and I just hope that, you know, obviously that they continue and they continue to do the good work. I mean, obviously what we'd all like is the fact that there would be no need for Beat, but unfortunately I don't see that in the foreseeable future. So I'd just like to say, Beat, continue your really good work and um, here's to 10 more fantastic years. Yeah. Happy birthday. Well done. And hopefully they're going to be here for another 10. Another 10 after that. And another 10 after that.